Hello and welcome, one and all. Uh, once again, it is your humble host and dungeon master, uh, Wolf Scott here from Level 1 Adventuring. A pleasure to have everyone. I'm going to adjust my mic volume just a tad so I don't uh, melt your eardrums. Welcome to Level 1 Adventuring. Uh, if you are new here, glad to have you. If you are not, also <laughs> so glad to have you. Uh, what is Level 1 Adventuring? We are primarily a... TTRPG and RPG focused stream so we do everything from playing big group games like you're probably familiar with like Dungeons and Dragons 5th edition we have an ongoing ca campaign that runs sometimes when we have the headcount uh, but I also run smaller solo indie RPGs and solo RPGs which are all available on both the Twitch and our YouTube platform and also when I can I like to stream some digital RPGs and of course the sort of the the big one right now uh to no one's surprise is Baldur's Gate 3 I'm a big D&D &D fan I'm a big Larian Studios fan so we're gonna take more bites out of BG3 uh there's my cat going crazy in the background uh <laughs> she's gonna hop into my gym bag probably if that's been her favorite place lately um please follow us on all the platforms uh you can keep up to date on all the live episodes here of course uh YouTube gets everything after the fact we post go lives on our Twitch and on our Discord. The Discord's where we meme, we chat, we have some fun. And very recently, uh, which is something I've been talking about for a while, but have only recently uh, committed to, uh, we are playing 5th edition D&D play-by-post on the Discord server as a community. Uh, the signups have just started now. So pretty much we have all the rules made for you to make a character, to learn more about the world that we're going to be playing in as a community, all of the different factions you can join. Uh, and then around December, we're going to actually open up the game for... Uh, I cast summoned friends! Whoop whoop! Nah, it's so good to see you! As I'm talking about the play-by-post right now. Uh, so yes, around December is when we're going to open. We're going to go live uh, with some adventure, as you can see, some friends in the chat who will be joining us. Um, so we hope to have you there, right? That's, that's, that's the long and short of all of that. Um, so yeah, follow us on all the things. Glad to have you here. BG3 is tonight. Cat in the background, making a little bed out of my gym bag. Everything is going exactly to plan. Uh, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna hit continue and try to remember... Oh, thank you, thank you. A posture check so early, I'm gonna need it. Ugh. We'll do one of these. A little, little... little you like my NASA shirt? Oh, if you can hear my spine cracking right now, that's that's legitimate spine cracking. That's not a that's not a foley effect, I promise you. Um All right, I'm going to remember where the hell we were at. I'm going to let the game load before I switch into screen mode. Uh just in case, you know, knock on wood. Mar -mar -mar -mar. <laughs> um but it's been a while. It's been a while since we booted up BG3. Uh, last time I remembered, we were just getting routinely having our uh, asses handed to us by giant spiders. And then eventually we won, which was which was kind of cool. Uh, <laughs> uh, also, I got like the worst string of rolls possible. I'm playing on balanced, and that fight felt like I was playing on Iron Man Hardcore because everyone died at least once. Um, all right, so it looks like... We're doing pretty good. I'll switch into BG3. Look at this. Look at this. We love to see it. We love to see. So, oh god, I look at me. I'm already. I'm already not remembering how any of the buttons work. Although I do have this really cool widget above my head. I'm like a sim right now. What? 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 Uh. What need needs fulfilling? I think we were going to go back to the Druid Grove because we were kind of venturing out pretty pretty far off. Uh, and we had no idea kind of where to go forward, but the Druid Grove seemed like to be the place where all the plot was happening. Uh, I cast him and Fred says, Sadly, it's 1 a.m. and the baby is just about going to sleep. Oh, sweet little babes. Uh, enjoy your adventures down. down. <laughs> well, uh, we hope to have you back soon one of these days, Summon Friends. Please check out Summon Friends' Twitch channel. Uh, they play pretty frequently weekly D&D. &D, uh, and I have also appeared on some of those episodes. I had a fun time as a swashbuckling half-elf. Uh, they're great people. So watch their streams. Have a good time. Um, but thank you for joining us, if even briefly. These tieflings prove fragile. I have a mind to end their misery myself. 
Lazel, chill. You're literally. They're survivors, not soldiers. Is that me speaking? First of all, we all know. We all know how this is Kirtran talks. Now, I've had some thoughts about Kirtran's personality, and what I've begun to realize is that, you know, before Kirtran uh, unlocked his uh, spooky uh, devil powers, uh, Kirtran was like a bit of a baby and like a shy little baby boy. Uh, so I think I'm going to try and uh, bring that out in the roleplay a little more. You know, he's he's not the the bravest uh, or the boldest, but he's he's sharp. Um, also, I see the squirrel here, which means I can probably talk to you. Oh, not attack! Come here, come here, little squirrel. Come here, little squirrel. Oh, look, he's so cute. Get out! Oh, okay. The squirrel lunges at your foot and bites it. Ah! <laughs> what is it? Another wolf stream. You won. We all won. Thank you, Fleetwood. We all won today. Um, okay. What is happening here? I'm gonna say I'm a friend. You barged in without an invitation. I wouldn't call that friendly. See, you're in my territory, and I want you gone. Timber, I'm sure that we can work out our differences. Uh, we are uh, similar. We have, uh, you know, poetic souls. Uh, you are of the, of the forest. Uh, I think my dad was like a devil or something. You know, there's there's kinship. Um, ooh, intimidate, huh? I don't know if I want to intimidate the squirrel. That seems awfully mean. There's plenty of room for the both of us. <laughs> Ooh, and I can add some bonuses. Yeah, give me... I only need to get a 10, right? Give me everything. Give me, give me, give me... Give me everything that I want to see. Nice. How about this? You can stay if you keep those ugly feet on the ground. Well, where else I'll would they go? The pot. Found some weird smelling stuff on the ground. You can keep it, but these trees are mine. Follow the rules and I won't ah. intervene. Got it? You don't want me to climb your little tree. <laughs> That's fine. Ooh, a potion of speed. Oh. Oh, sorry, no. It's literally just the ear of a hyena <laughs> that we can turn into a potion of the speed uh, if we are so bold. But for now, I'll just thank you for the hyena ear, uh, small furry woodland friend. <laughs> I won't climb your tree. Uh, what if we go over here, though? Oh, well, I failed a survival check. Hey, look, everyone, come over here. <laughs> Ah, oh. What is this? A bugbear assassin? Were you guarding this random thing? Where are you even? Do I even know where you are? Oh. Very sneaky. But not sneaky enough. Uh, Alright, so Asterion can do bonus action hide. So let's start with that. And then let's get him moving. moving. Oh, can I bonus action? Is jumping... I forget how jumping works. It's been a while. Um, jumping's like an action now, right? 10 feet of movement speed. So if I were to dash... Right? Oh, but that's a full action. 
Darn it. Oh, wait, no, I can do a cunning action dash. Oh, this is, this is what we want to see. Now we're thinking with portals. Uh, yeah, I think I can get, like, real close to him. And just... Oh, maybe I can bite him. That'd be pretty sick. Oh, it's a bonus action. Nope. No bites for me. But I could at least... That's sneaky. Let's do a little sneaky sneak. If I wanted to, could I just get up there and just stab the ever-loving hell out of him? I guess I should probably try and shoot, right? Yeah, 84% chance, why not? Nice. Great job, Stallion. You're just doing wonderfully. Now, please come back down here before you hurt yourself. Step quick. <laughs> Can he come all the way back down here? No, that'd be sweet. All right, we'll end the Stallion's turn. Oh, okay. You're going to poison your Morning Star and Dash. Okay, so you're you mean business. Oh, but you don't have enough business to give us the business. Get out of here with that. Um, okay. So, first things first. Oh, gosh. I have to remember everything. Um, I want to... I want to... Warlock spell slots. I want to give you that good old-fashioned hex, baby. I want to say your strength is garbage. Nice. And then I want to just wreck your life with an Eldritch Blast. Like that. That's how we do it. And then, as always, I end my turn playing a, a very uh, inspirational song for my friends. Uh, like, uh, how about Sing For Me? <laughs> Ah, yes. My sultry sounds will guide you to victory, friends. <laughs> uh, we'll enter in there. Yeah, speaking of victory. um, Can't you just, like, charge the hell out of someone? You have, like, a really good charge attack, right? Pommel strike. Lacerate. Yeah, rush attack. Get in there. Path is interrupted. Okay, never mind. Oh, you don't have that much movement speed, do you? That's unfortunate. Oh, but if I dash, I could maybe just pommel strike him. You know, and then just, like, throw him off a little bit. My path be true. My path be true. Can you hear me, Lacelle? This one's for you. Nice. Get stuffed. He's got one health left. Come on. It's all right. We'll 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 let we'll let Shadowheart really take this one home. Um, oh, she has Firebolt as well, but that's only a thirty-five percent chance of hitting Sacred Flame. Fifty. And that is what you get for trying to sneak up on me and my friends, like a little, like a little dirty shadow. I don't know why it's not letting me interact with this dirt mound anymore. Anything of use? Anything of use? Uh, I need to rest. The sunset can't come quickly enough. Why everyone just standing around looking kind of confused here? Also, I have to remember. Oh, nope, that's not the button I want. Nope, that's not the button I want. Ah, yes. Option is the button I want that makes things super visible. I do have a shovel though, right? Got to press on. Yeah. Oh, but Asterion has it. 
Maybe that's why? Let's go back to our boy. Let's move. Here we go. I don't, what is going on here? This seems simple enough. It was digging before. We'll come back to this. Moving in. Ooh. Something good here, I hope. Oh wait. Uh, let's all be sneaky for a second. A soul coin. The nerves and mind. A medical compendium. Okay. Okay, nothing immediately. All right, I was hoping maybe there'd be like a quest trigger or something. I mean, definitely gonna take this and that. Um, I don't think we need the books. This, this is the battlements that we just walked through. More goblins. Glad you were here for those goblins. Picked one off yesterday myself. Shot her through the throat. That should have killed her, but she kept gasping. Yes, those goblins can be a quite tenacious. <laughs> Taking life always has a cost. You have to feel it, or else you'll lose who you are. I had the same thought. And it's just going to keep happening. Ah, so young. <laughs> so impressionable. Oh, there's more. More tiefling friends this way. Glad you made it inside. That will be safe here for long, though. There will be more coming. Goblins hunting packs. Hmm. Why not take your chances on the road? We might have to. But I'd feel better if we at least knew how many are out there. The sooner we leave for Baldur's Gate, the better. How far are we from the city? If the road was clear, a ten days walk, maybe. But while the goblins are out there, it might as well be the other side of the world. Aradin's back with his tail between his legs. I'm glad for your help, but I'd hoped you were Halson. Ah, I've heard this word before. Um, was this name? <laughs> Which I suppose is also a word. <laughs> I'm a bard. I understand words. Um, I like using the, the special options. Uh, if I don't help my king, uh, who will? Ain't that Bashar's bitter truth? It's appreciated. Trust me. Well, I suppose we shouldn't keep these humble folk waiting. Eh. Got a camp set up here. Oh, wait. Oh, wait, we just spoke to Kaldani. Wow, you moved quick, Kaldani. You were in that corner a moment ago. Um, oh, Cayman's belongings, huh? All right, good to know. That sounds like a quest quest uh, marker if I ever saw one oh this doesn't count as stealing if I look in this wooden box so uh, don't mind me Tanner's delight oh oh you know what I didn't realize did I actually... No, I guess it would tell me if I... What the... I guess it would tell me if I picked up that chest, right? I don't see one in my inventory. I swear there was a chest when we were digging, and then we got interrupted. And now it won't let me interrupt with, in, interact with that mound again. It's just, it's... I'm so perplexed, and I'm so... 
curious. The hollow. Disintegrating journal. There's so many things I want to look at. Refugees, adventurers, no one in years, and suddenly we're overwhelmed. Well met, and thank you for beating back those goblins. Most brave of you. Is there anything you need? Act fast if you do. The ritual will be complete before too long. Oh, well. Oh, well, that is true. Uh, I'm looking for a healer. I pray no goblin arrow has grazed you. <laughs> no, we certainly rest. have not uh, she should be with made the friends the with any goblins lately either. So. She'll be taking on new patients. The grove will be locked down soon. And what do you mean? Ah, I forgot. You're a blow-in. A few days hence, this we just will met, be friend. <laughs> concealed by thorny vines. None will be able to enter or leave. A drastic measure. But more monsters seem to terrorize this region every day. What about the people here? Sony Vines? The Druids will be safe. As for those that took refuge here, well, may Sylvanas guard them as they continue their travels. Ah. Casting out the tieflings, how original. I don't want this to happen either. But Korga makes the decisions. Sounds like I Korga and I should have a little discussion. Protect them. Your prayers won't save them, but your voice might sway Korga. You don't know Korga. She won't listen. I'm truly sorry. Well, she hasn't met me, so... Need anything else? What do you sell? Just some bits and bobs I no longer need. Just some bits and bobs I no longer need. Oh god, bits and bobs. He has, like, magical gear. He's got plus one armor. You don't need that? It's just lying around for you, for you, pal? Okay. Interesting. Um. Sell wares. God, this is... This is just a lot to look at right here. Throwing boost. <laughs> uh, I never throw things, but that's hilarious. Uh, a cool axe. Okay, good to know. A cool staff. Some armor that I don't think I can wear. Okay, we'll come back. We'll think about it. Thank you, Alan. Very, very nice Sylvanas to meet you. Oh, let's get into an argument. <laughs> that sounds fun. Bells, we can't just leave. They're kin. I'll not gamble our lives, our futures, on people who are as good as dead. We must leave for Baldur's Gate at once. Can we all just take a moment, please? What's the point in blazing spells if we don't bloody use them? We should stay. These people aren't fighters. We can help. Or yell louder. That's <laughs> fine, too. Uh oh. Have you forgotten, Elturel? We should stand by our people. No one else will. Elturel, very nice nod to um out of the no no no. Descent into Avernus. I was gonna say out of the abyss, but that's the demon adventure. Uh Descent into Avernus is the devil adventure where uh, some terrible things happened to Elturel. So, very nice nod, writing team. This isn't Elturel, and I'm not responsible for every damn tiefling in the world. Just be responsible for yourself, then. We have to stay. It's the right thing to do. So, fine. We'll stay. If we survive, it'll make for a good story, I suppose. Thank you, Roland. Ah, well, you were actually surprisingly uh, reasonable, all things considered. <laughs> we should have left by now. Damnation! Instead, we're just sitting here, practically begging to be attacked. Staying is a mistake. So eager to go to Baldur's Gate, do they even welcome tieflings? More than most. A few strangers may stare, but they'll keep their daggers cheap. I'll be warmly received. Besides, you are looking at Leroican's newest apprentice. 
Yes, that Laroican. The greatest wizard in Baldur's Gate. I'm sure Gale would have something to say to that that line. Is this a Laroican of Ramesses Tower? His name is known far and wide, I see. Few can match him in terms of raw power and talent. Until now, that is. In years to come, you will boast of this meeting, I can assure you. Oh yeah, we well, in years state. to come, you will also boast of this meeting, but because I am impressive and you are not as much, so... Okay, goodbye. Told you. Oh, dude, can I talk to these ox? <laughs> I have to speak with animals on. This place is a bloody death trap, not a sanctuary. You should clear off while you can. Be gone. I am hungry. Oh, well, I would feed you. Another one. What are you under there, then? Ant. Or rocks. <laughs> um, what are you talking about? The keepers of this place. They change their form to fit their need. Oh, because they're druids. They become birds to hunt on the wing. Bears to tear flesh with teeth. But for me, only oxen, only same old hair. <laughs> Are you a cow and that... I cannot even eat it. Because the horned ones hide their shiny bits inside. Oh... A shiny bits? Is it tieflings put something in your hay? Hiding things. Thinking they're clever. Not clever. Sometimes I eat the shiny bits, and they have to go looking for them on the other end. Wow, a whole... Oh, wait. That's a little bit more than... I thought it was only two gold. That's nah, thirty-one gold. That's decent. Huh? You're addressing me, a humble ox. How quaint! There's something strange about this ox. I'm thinking this because it is in italics. What is it? Uh, 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 darling Shad Shadow Heart, if you wouldn't mind. Nice. Something's off. This creature isn't what it appears to be. There's more to you than meets the eye. Care to explain? No. You are incapable. I would wager that I'm more capable <coughs> as I die. <coughs> Choking on a piece of popcorn from earlier. Oh my god, I'm a devil for gossip. I'm literally a devil. I can't resist the pun. Come on, old chap. I'm a devil for gossip, ah? Huh? Well, I could also friends him. <coughs> Bangarang, baby. I'll tell you this much. I'm going to Baldur's Gate, with or without the rest of these poor sods. No. That's all I have to say besides, and I really mean this. Move. <coughs> Nothing here for Fuck you. Well, um, you're sus. I'm a little worried about you, but, you know, we'll get there. We'll get there. He stares right past you as if you're invisible. 
Awful boring. As far as I'm aware, I am nicer of these things. <laughs> Turn around to see what he's looking at. That's kind of funny. I'm gonna do it. You see nothing out of the ordinary. As you turn back, the child slips between the rocks. Ooh. You find the edges of a concealed entrance. Ah. Hello. Little sneaky boy. Hmm. <laughs> you're not at least, you know, somewhat surprised that I followed you into your, you know, weird little hovel that's not the uh, something that interests you in the slightest. Okay, well, we tried. Ooh, what's this? Uh, what's my jump distance? Target is too far. Maybe for you, but what about for? Lazelle's a pretty strong gal. Mm, maybe a little too out of her, out of her range. Okay. What's well. Should mind my step. Is there more of you down here? Can I? Is there, or should I say, is there more of well, me? Look who's come to visit. My kids say you've been busy since you got here. Not sure why you're poking your nose in our business, though. Did did she just walk up to Asterian and have this conversation like all on her own? Okay, that's funny. You're funny because of that. I'll give you a ten count to leave. <laughs> Is this where I do my best hysteria impression? You're joking, right? <laughs> Nine. Eight. Well, I don't want to attack all these kids, so... We'll come back for you later. We'll learn more about you. You sneaky little so-and-sos. Let me show you something. Go on. Take this ring. It's lucky. That was a fancy trick. You haven't seen anything yet, mister. Go on. Take the ring. I think I've seen some change. things. I saw that very lucky ring, for instance. I can try to mimic the trick. <laughs> I am a bard, right? I am a showman. Even if I might beef it, I gotta try. Might get lucky. I did get lucky! And voila! Weeping, bleeding hells! I okay, know. Maybe you don't need extra luck. But since you're already holding the thing... Call it. Heads or tails? On a ring? Uh, okay. Well, uh, I, we both have tails, so tails. Tails it is! See? That's the kind of luck you get from one of my lucky rings. I've got more where that came from. Real cheap, too. Interested? Ah. <sighs> I hate to be the bearer of bad news, but this is no magic ring. The runes are gibberish. I should know my face is covered in magic runes that, as far as I am aware, are not gibberish. Hey, not so loud. You caught me. All right. They're not lucky rings. I'm just trying to earn money for my family. My father left and my mother. She's so sick. I wish I had better things to sell than trinkets, but it's all I have. Hmm. 
<laughs> uh, I don't know if I would. Uh, would I call? Would I call them out? Or is it like none of my business? You know what I mean? Like I'm an entertainer. I know when people are putting things on. But would I call this kid out? Especially knowing that the tieflings are kind of like suffering here. Yeah, all right, take your ring. What do you have to trade? Thank you. That means so much. That's what I got. Ah, uh, nice. I'm inspired. I did fail a perception check, which means I'm assuming this kid just nicked something off of me. That little... Oh, wait, what? Ring of being really invisible. <laughs> Ring of infinite wishes. Ring of resistance to ants. Ring of the Lekinesis. <laughs> oh, that's goofy. Um, how about I, I just have some of the, your little thieves' tools? I could use those. And maybe a supply pack. Yes, that's a, a, a noble... You're doing a noble deed. Selling your, your, your fine wares... And you know, I, I could also learn to do that as well. Balance offer. The trader will be pleased with this offer. I don't know. <laughs> Uh, sure. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> oh, I guess I could sell. What are these? Oh, when did I get enchanted bracers? This shows you uh, the ones the last time I looked at my inventory. I have like cool magical things that I'm not using. Yeah, I mean, I'm not going to use... Most of this stuff, I don't think. There you go. Nice. Thank you, good lad. Ah, uh, and now I think I take my leave of you. You bought something. Most everybody says it looks like junk and moves on. I just wanted to support a young businessman. Oh, you have. You definitely have. Anyway, see you again sometime. Take care. Safe travels. You realize your bag feels light. You were just robbed. <laughs> of course I was. Well, I know you're probably hiding out in the hovel with all the other little tiefling kids. Oh, no, you're right here. Well, why are you just... You're very bad at hiding after robbing someone. Hey, you're back. Here to buy some stuff? Have you taken something? Something that, oh, I don't know, doesn't happen to belong to you and maybe belongs to someone else like maybe me? Me? No, promise. I'm just a kid trying to make a living. You know who you should talk to? Moll. She's my boss, I guess. Good at finding stuff. Her office is through the crack in the wall over there, if you can fit. Then I'll get my answers out of her. You bet. Good luck, pal. You've just made my life infinitely Except harder. Oh, um, why? <laughs> 
I have just been robbed. <laughs> have you seen anyone acting suspiciously other than you, who is standing here clutching your trousers uh, nervously? Me? Suspicious? No. Exactly what someone not suspicious would say. <laughs> uh, do you know of any sieves around here? No, I sure don't. I'll go ask my boss for you, right now. Her name wouldn't happen to be Maul, would it? Alright, so this seems to go... Oh, there's obviously a scene down here. Let's hold off on that. Can we confront Maul? Or is she just gonna, like, shake us down to get out of her hidey hole? Where are you going? I want to talk to you. Not a chance I'll fit in there. Okay, uh well this was lovely, I suppose. Oh, but you haven't run away. And you're standing by oh and this one. Jeez. All of the most useful people here. Oh. Hello again. Um. Mole's in charge here, not me. Ah, uh, wonderful. Every person I meet is more. You're the first grown up who's ever gotten in here. Not bad. Okay, well, I. It's. I don't want to. Well, actually. Is it wrong to steal from a thief? Hysterian? <laughs> uh, let's go hide. On tippy toes. On tippy toes. Okay, first of all, if, if he's gonna try and Silence steal, let's not everyone follow right behind him. You know. Let's break up the gang for a second, and let's... To the shadows. Let's keep to the shadows. Maybe that's all you have. They won't see me coming. Let's have a rummage. Is that how you... Pickpocket, you walk directly in front of the person. An excellent strategy. Truly, never would have saw it coming, Astarian. All right, let's get out of here. Maul ran. All right. Who even knows? Who even knows? Man, there's so many people to talk to here. Oh, but I know who we should talk to. Probably you. Right, right, box art character? I have something to ask. Seems Mole was as good as her word. She's reported that you've been threatening children. <laughs> oh, those kids. Is it playing a joke on me? Yes. Do I want to make this guard mad with if I use a scroll of charm person? Hmm. 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 
this says they have a chance of noticing me. This one doesn't. Maybe I just wing it. I mean, what? I have a I have a potential bonus of five, six, seven. Hmm. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Yeah, average bonus of seven. So I just can't roll a six or lower. I'll just do it straight. Perfect. Your words may be false, but they ring truer than Mole's tales. You're off the hook. Well, we're going to have to have a stern talking to Maul, will we not? Go on. Give me a best shot. Not bad. Again. I can't do it. I'm not like you. Well, you're very tiny. I don't need you to be like me. You just have to buy enough time to run. Come on. I believe in you. You can do this. <laughs> uh, it's good advice, child. Uh, you do well to listen. Hmm. You're on the right path, Umi. Go on now. Practice what you've learned. Well met. The Blade of Frontiers at your... The man's smile bends downward, and his thoughts become yours. You are the blade of frontiers racing through the wastes of Avernus. Just ahead, a diabolical figure, red skin, single curled horn, blazes with flame, bloodied great axe held high. <sighs> Hell's great fires. You are on the ship. Or what gave it away? The weird uh, slug headaches that we're all seeming to have together? Um. Hmm. Yeah, let's 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 not press into his past so quickly. Another escapee. Thanks of gods. I need all the friends I can get. Better friends than the ones hitching a ride in our skulls, at least. Oh, okay, so you're going to bring it up. Thank you. Doomed to shed our skin and become a lipid. They say there's no coming back. But we haven't sprouted any tentacles. Not yet, anyway. Could just be good luck. I'm not so... Your minds collide once more. Wind chases the fiend ignited with rancor. She is an infernal war devil. A threat to the living. Evil incarnate. Shit! You saw her. Advocatus Diaboli. Advocatus Diaboli. A devil's advocate. A champion in the blood war between diabolical forces and demons. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, I'm smart too. <laughs> a devil's advocate. Do you think she'll bring the blood war to favor? That ship sailed the sticks already. All I can hope for is to limit the damage. Her name is Karlak, an archdevil soldier I swore on my good eye to kill. I tracked her through the hells to the Mind Flayer ship, but the damned Elithids infected me before I could end her. She's out there now, preying on the innocent. I don't kill her. She'll leave behind nothing but a trail of corpses. <laughs> I'm looking to cure this infection. I suggest we partner up. Just so you know, my first duty is Karlak. I'm oath bound to go after her. But I won't deny this infection is bothersome. I accept your invitation. 
You'll need to make room if you want to partner up, though. Still, when the time comes, call for the blade. I won't be long to answer. Go to my camp and wait for me, sir. A splendid plan. We'll talk more then. Alright, who else can we... Children! Look who's here! And again! Swing and swing! I saw you at the gates. You fight well. A few words for the kids. Spare a story or two. <laughs> Be strong and watch over your kin. And trust there is victory. Thanks. I prefer when they smile. Quex. Step, parry, strike, damn it! It's just not land. This is the guy who was trying to fight me? Uh, interesting technique. Uh, having some trouble? Nothing but. Goblins in the wild, out for blood, and the druids in here looking to kick us out. Or worse. We need to be ready for a fight. But I'm useless with a sword. <laughs> um. Ooh, wisdom is like my worst save. <sighs> That's all all my worst saves. Um. And I have disadvantage. Jesus. Um. I don't think I can do anything here. What is uh what is going on with my Let's get going. character sheet? I got some really bad thing happening to me here. Whispers of madness. I'm cursed. Okay. Do you have... Do you have remove curse? Mirror image warding bond. No, you don't. Can you learn it? Tenacity. Hmm. Is that blood? I'm gonna have to no, get rid of that. Might. That disadvantage on wisdom is gonna be a real killer for me. All right. Yeah. Oh yeah. I'll take the camp supplies. By Mordai's eyes. Another one. My friend's blood not enough. Come to rip me open too. In Kresh Kalir, a formal greeting begins with a bow. Is this monster with you? All right, Lazel. Let's, you know, just calm it down. Show some sympathy. He's terrified. Has the tadpole ravaged your senses? Sympathy will not lead us to purity. I'm, I don't think I have it within me to to bark at her. It's not really in my nature. Fine, do as you must, but make it quick. Bow. Lower. Oh, stop it. He suffered Has enough. The tadpole ravaged your senses. It is his suffering that will lead us to purity. Enough, Lazel. You will be silent. <laughs> uh, 
you can breathe again. I won't let her hurt you. Thanks. What do you want from me? Information. Where did you see this kiss Yankee? On the road, the Baldur's Gate. N near the mountain pass. S saw us, for we saw it. Jammed its blade through Yul's belly. Straight to the other side. Man, I just... I just... ran. The map. Show me. Thanks for your help. And apologies for my companion. No hard feelings. Oh, he's actually a pretty decent guy. He reacted very well, considering that she was kind of an ass. God, and I enabled her a bit. <laughs> I should speak up. Oh, wait. Oh. Goblins, druids. This grove is a death trap. Grab what you can and get out. That's my advice. She has a little conversation marker. I've got food, water. The last time a subordinate questioned my judgment, I ate tongue stew that very night. I warned you, didn't I? You ought to reconsider keeping her around before she causes real trouble. Beautiful, perfect, darling, Shadowheart. Don't, don't worry. <laughs> subordinate. We are partners. You'll treat me with respect. Kenyak, your tantrum proves you no wiser than a hatchling. The teasling was clear. You if can't even pronounce the word you call me rejected. hatchling. Purification cannot wait. <laughs> Thank you. That is what I... That is exactly the line I want. Uh, we are teethlings with an F. <laughs> I am unfamiliar with the that was the well, most I like not say culture. Custom, <laughs> over exemplified me on matters of this fey run <laughs> like over animated eye roll I love that uh, no it's fey rune Now that that is out of the way, what do you mean purification? The Kresh holds the Zathisk. It will cleanse us of the parasite. By covenant, I can say no more. Do you have a gun? Oh no, you have a crossbow. Am I just holding a gun right now? You ain't gonna shoot me. Your hands are shaking. Put it down. She can't fight back. That's the point. Get out of the way. She didn't kill your brother, Arca. You're better than this. Shoot before you lose your nerve, Tieflin. If you ever had it to be Ooh, you. Ooh, a little hostage situation. Looks like the Absolute <laughs> sent me a Gail professor. approves. You're not even there. You're gonna kill him too. You move. <laughs> uh, no, shoot me. Should be easy, right? Oh, it's a low roll, but I do have some bonuses. Ah, oh, I just made it. What in every hell is wrong with you? Damn you. Damn it. Why do you care if a goblin lives or dies? Ooh, I love getting the special options. She still has a story to tell. One, 
I want to hear. T your soft heart will be the death of us. Gods, you're exhausting. Fine, then. It's all right, Arca. Let's go. All right, now let's have a talk with you. Ain't sure why you're protecting me. Don't care, neither. It's too late to make friends warg me. My tribe's coming. They're gonna burn this pretty place for the glory of the Absolute and hang you by your guts. I just saved your life. It shows some gratitude. They'll peel your face off and nail it to a wall. I ain't scared of some god. Stick a dozen arrows in me, and Priestess God still patch me up. Got a whole lab set up, cooks up potions that fix our lads, no matter how much of a beating they take. Are you are telling me a lot. <laughs> stick your head back on if someone was to chop it off. <laughs> My booyah. I'm not saying we should trust a goblin, <laughs> but she sounds very useful. This is such a bard response. Nice story. A bite for copper, copper in a tavern nearby. It's the truth. I swear on your mother's grave. Get me out of here and I'll tell you where to find her. Deal? You've already told me what I need to know. I'll find the priestess myself. <laughs> Even if you did find my tribe, they set the wargs on you. You need me. Get me out of here, and I'll tell them what a good friend you are. I don't think we're ready to make that kind of alliance just yet. I'll give it a shot. Oh, this was where we snuck in before. Okay. There is so much to see in this zone. Oh, I keep hitting, I keep thinking that's the button that I want. Hell's take me. What I wouldn't do for better tools. Hell's take me. We got Damon, we got Zaki. We got a rat running around here. Oh. Stay back, or else. Or else, well, no. I'm not mean. What's wrong? Nothing's wrong. Just get back. Ow! Oh, my tooth. Let me take a look. It's the front one. I chipped it on the evil thing. What evil thing? In the box. Follow me, I'll show you. Um, okay, well, I suppose if the rat told us we can do it, you know. Shame the goblins didn't kill me, too. Don't really consider. I'm just sad. Easy. And bored. Why are you rolling so Try it. Wow. We needed every little bit we could get there. it was not you speaking Asterian um 
but you're probably decent at this. Yeah. Yeah, you're decent at this. I can give him another inspiration. Um, ability check or saving throw. I mean, I hardly get to use it. Why not? Oh my god. Never mind. Didn't even need it. Damn it. I was inventory today. I'm sorry. Nerves are shot after the attack. Do what you gotta do. Sorry if I don't show you around. I need a hand up. <laughs> I just fall back down. Legs are as steady as a foal's. Bloody potion. I'd wager your potion was a paralyzing agent. What? No, the potion worked. I'm strong as a bugbear and fearless. The old lady warned me that this might happen, that it was a side effect. It sounds like you've been duped. No, she's been nothing but kind to me. Why would she? Ah, oh, you're starting Sorry, to put it together. I oh. Need a moment. I'm not. Maybe you should tell us where this old lady is that's giving people sure junk potions. Can't give up now. things in the chest are you awake or are you sleeping no. like if I try to get in there just in out of view I'm just waiting step in smells taste a key what do you think's evil in here Cabinet key. Alright, well, we got a key. I don't know why the rat thinks it's evil. Oh, that's why. Drow poison. Oh. At least things have stayed interesting. Wait, I want to talk to you, rat. We did it. We we did it with your help. I want to talk to you. The evil thing gone. No, where was I? <laughs> well, thank you for your service. Should mind my step. I want to get this. Uh... We got this. Yeah, I'm gonna take this. This is on soul coins, which we've picked up one. So I feel like it's probably worth having that for the future. Okay. Nope, no, no, no. I just wanna get the gang back together. Are we in group mode? Are we, what are we doing here? Time to press I think everyone's confused, okay. Uh, backpack, Druid's Ledger seems like an interesting Why thing to have. Yeah, uh, but it's kind of hard to take. Unless... If I go over here... What if I use... Where are my cantrips? Can I throw it over here? Have all the bloody things to happen. Wait, what? Oh my god. You had to get all the way out of the house to do it? Shouldn't have 
wished to live in more interesting times. Where did you throw it? <laughs> what? Uh what? What do you do with, with the book? Wait, what? Oh, I don't think I wanted to do that. I didn't know that someone saw me do that. Uh, okay. Maybe... Maybe we pretend that we didn't do that dumb thing. <laughs> I didn't think... I thought the mage hand move was, like, kind of smooth. I thought nobody saw me do that. But it looks like someone very much saw us do that. Audio is acting a little wonky right now. Whoa, Mochi! I just saw you uh, redeemed the the dragon coin. I didn't see that pop in the the chat. Thank you so much. Hi, what's going on? I think I made. Oh, I should have. I should have done another quick save. All right, we'll just we'll just speed run through this conversation since I botched it. Wait, can I not talk to you? Ain't sure why you're protecting me. Don't. It's they gonna burn this pretty place for the glory. Right, right, right. You're mad. Probably... And then Astarian so says that, and we say, oh, it's get me out of here. And, and then I, I already know. Okay. You need me. Get me out of here. Okay, so we did all this. Ah, oh, that's so dumb. I wish Mage Hand was a little bit more invisible. <laughs> I mean, I guess it's not invisible in the base game, but like, I like did the action outside of the ring. I don't know. But good to see you, Mochi. It's been a little while. Well, if we see our rat friend, we'll talk to him again, and we'll do that that little sojourn where we learned about the poison again. Hopefully soon. You don't look so tough. Maul fought off a hobgoblin all by herself. Maul also was a little tattletale and told everybody that I found her in Never. her cave. Or else. We were at the same Halloween party. Oh, you were at the big, uh, the dance thing in Brooklyn? Hell yeah! Nothing's wrong. Yes, okay, 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 okay. Uh, yes. It's the front one. I chipped it only in the box. Right, right, right. Okay, see here we now we're back on track. The rats leading us to where we gotta go. Open up. Yeah, um, that's so funny, Moch. Uh I was like very overwhelmed that day. <laughs> there was a lot going on there. It was fun, I had a good time. But it was very overwhelming. And we left kind of early, uh, because you know, maybe we've had a little bit too much witch's brew and we needed to go take a nap. Uh but it was fun, it was a good time. All right, let's try this lockpick again. Do I really need? No, I just I just can't botch it. Uh, Moj says, "Pretty sure I walked by you guys. I was trapped in the room of mirrors, seeing my bands. Oh, nice." Yeah, I only went into one of the side rooms, which was like the spider room, I guess, but it even wasn't that spidery. It was, it was interesting, though. I had fun. I had fun, I had fun watching that one band play, uh... Stop! This place is off limits! Okay, so yes, we met you, but now we're meeting you as me. Uh, and I said, don't worry, I'm here to help, as always, because I'm such a nice good boy. Um, and same thing. Wow, I'm actually glad I used the advantage. Excuse me. Damn it! I was inventory.
entry today. Do yes, it was. Do. Sorry. And then I yes, we learned that you're poisoned. <laughs> Sounds like it was quite the dodgy brew. Where did you get this potion? From the old lady in the cave. To her credit, it worked. Okay, we learned that. So warned of side effects. Should have listened. Now I'm stuck guarding crates. Oh wow, nice! I can help because I'm a bard. That's so cool. Actually, I love that I, I re-talked to her as as Kirtren. Um. Oh my god. I uh, know I don't think I'd extort her. She's a fellow tiefling. I'm trying to help all my my fellow tieflings. That doesn't sound like a side effect at all. Let me heal you. <sighs> all right. I guess being fearless won't help if an arrow comes flying right at me. Hold still and I'll cast a spell. But wait, do I even have a spell that helps her? I don't know if I do. Level one spell slot. I have Hellish Rebuke, Cure Wounds. Yeah, I don't know why. Does Shadowheart have it? Oh, you know what? Um. Oh, wow. Someone crowd surfed in a coffin? I definitely missed that. Managed to crowd surf to the back of the room and back onto stage in a coffin? That's incredible. That sounds like I'm actually very sad that I missed that. Never a dull moment. All right, so then once again, we're going to get a Starian over here. We're going to tell him to do a little hide. Uh, he is going to open the chest. He's going to take the key. He's going to use the key to take that. He's going to take this just like before. Um, and then we'll use Kertrin to talk to our rat friend. The evil thing gone. There we go. See, now we are back to where we were. Oh, thank you. <laughs> she like stood you up and still heal me, right? Hold still, and I'll cast the spell. I don't have the spell. Oh no. <laughs> uh, but maybe we can find one. We might also, let me take a look in my um, scroll. I have Feather Fall, Flaming Sphere, Witch Bolt, Hypnotic Pattern, Ice Knife, Detect Thoughts, Charm Person, Speak with Dead, Burning Hands, Enlarge, no. I bet you I can find the right thing maybe at the potion shop. And the goblins didn't kill me too. We'll talk about it. But now at least we're back where we were before I made that dumb mistake. Thanks for fighting off those goblins. If you need to replace any gear, just ask. My selection's pretty slim. I had to leave most of my equipment in Elturel. The forge is holding on by a sled. Are you a smith? Of sorts. Used to be a bread and butter tinsmith before Elturel fell into Avernus. These days, my talents are more eclectic. Learned Go, a lot uh, my time in the hells. <laughs> uh, uh, what's the word? But Chatbot is being, a, as usual, pretty strict no here. What's going on? A, be <laughs> a beefy bear in bondage? Look at all that alliteration. BBB. Let me see your wares. Uh, okay, so once again, you have, it seems to be some interesting lightly enchanted gear i'll have to remember that these are actually kind of in my price range though surprisingly huh 
one. Dexterity saving throws plus one. A shield plus one. These aren't like bad. Padded armor plus one. Don't want to spend money on. Eh. I feel like I'm gonna find better armor though. Maybe. Easy game of the year, Govinda. Happy to have you on the stream. We have Mochi and Govinda, old friends from from flesh and blood and online. Uh, I'm still very new into into the into the game, Govinda. I mean, obviously you know that I have a lot of D and D lore in my head, but I'm still very fresh into the campaign. But yeah, it's incredible. Uh, I will take my leave of you. I miss my forge. Okay, so we know that there's a lady selling shady potions. Probably you, huh? Is this girl named Octa? <laughs> like the, like the digital protection service? Are you gonna ask me about my password? Those goblins will rue the day they chose to tangle with this grove. You and I will do some good here. I can feel Oh, it. yeah, I helped you talk down what's his face at those. Like, why are you talking to me so familiar? I don't know you, lady. No, no, actually, I do know you. I've put in about 150 hours and started my third playthrough. Govinda, you are, you are going to be able to guide me to victory. <laughs> but also, uh, speaking to Mochi and Govinda. Uh, speaking of D and D, hey, the play-by-post server on the Discord is live. If you want to play some D and D with the community, you. we'll see you there. You fighting those slimy bastards. Please tell me that one of your playthroughs, Gavinda, was Silvar, the Elven Ranger, or else I, my heart will be broken. Um. <laughs> ah, a bowl of grey goo reminds me of home. You've been on hard times too, huh? So many sexies in this game. I know this game is just like, it's just like uh, made for you to ship, right? Like every character is like, uh, is just some character that you can secretly fall in love with. Oh, Mochi, thank you for the nine, uh, nine months. For some reason, my audio for the, uh, the sub sounds are acting real weird, but I thank you for that sub. Um, first was a gnome wizard, very different to what, uh, I'm used to you playing, Govinda, and second was a Dwarven Paladin. Okay, so you're really painting the swath of all possible combinations here. Um, you've been on hard times too, yeah? Eh, no worse than what you're facing now. Hm. Look in your eyes, says otherwise. Here, have more. We'll need every bit of strength to make it to Baldur's Gate. Trust me. Item received. Gruel. All right, so obviously you're not the lady selling shady potions, so it's gotta be this lady selling shady potions, huh? Ah, uh, if it isn't the talk of the camp. Thank goodness you came along when you. Oh, there isn't a bit of color in those cheeks, Petal. Are you harsh? Cold. Harsh! Cold! Auntie Ethel will sort you out. I've lotions and potions. <laughs> I've lotions and potions. She she studied her IPA. She studied her international phonetic alphabet to get that accent down. Oh, let her fuss over you. I love that as an option. I feel like I absolutely would do that. This bar just wanting to be pampered. But wait! I know that she is selling the shady potions. Uh... I don't know yet, I guess. I'm assuming. And we know what happens when you assume of old ladies. So we should just be nice. I'd want to just let her fuss over us for a little bit. Oh, yes, my cheeks uh, are so pale. You'll take a sip of that and you'll feel right as rain, sweetie. <laughs> uh, now here's where we should start being a little more discerning. Um... And what is this exactly? I know, Govinda, I'm trying to, like, not meta. <laughs> like, I have some information from other characters, but we haven't sussed it out in this interaction. So we don't want to be a jerk, you know? But all fingers are pointing towards this lady. Oh, it is just a healing potion. Nothing fancy. Here. You 
just look like you might need a pick-me-up. Well, I also I just killed like a bunch of goblins, so you, you know. Right? You're looking awful peaky. I'm fine, just a bone weary. Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah. I've been better. It's a uh, difficult to explain as I hold my head and have a, a tadpole induced <laughs> migraine. Oh, I've seen it all. I once had a fella who'd been caught dabbling with a dryad. Oh, do tell. Spills the tea. Used him to a pot of boiling oil. But worry not. I fixed him up. And depending on the lighting, <laughs> he looks good as new. My point is, whatever ails you, I promise I've seen worse. Ah, uh, well, you can't really She's see not it. To know of the, our ailment. Only a gith healer may make us pure. What is it, Petal? What's wrong? Oh, no, they're going to make me choose between the sweet old lady and the mean girl who always yells at me. What a, what a dilemma. <laughs> uh, there's nothing wrong. I swear everything is fine. As you wish, Petal. Now, do you need anything? I have a few odds and ends for sale. Ah, what harm? Show me your wares. Hey, bother. Do you have something? A potion of visibility. Oh, okay. Okay. Corellian's Grace. Uh, that sounds like something really good for a monk, which uh, none of us are. Um, uh, I would love to have some sort of potion to help that poor lady in the shed, but alas. Take care now, sweetie. Volo's Guide to the Behavior of Nymphs. Okay. So I think we've seen, oh no, we haven't talked to him up there. Oh, stone door. Every time I think I've, I've, I've checked this camp out, there's, there's another little, another little secret hiding around the corner. Uh, actually, let me look in my potions real quick. Uh, what do I got here? Hill giant strength, mind reading, animal speaking, flying, feather fall. <laughs> I have arsonist oil, uh, sleep. I have an antidote. Neutralizes the effects of all poisons. Neutralizes the effects of all poisons, huh? Do you think if I threw that on that girl who has her legs paralyzed right now from a po do you think that would work? The dialogue prompt asked me for a spell, but like, you know, what if this is just like a creative bit of problem solving? <laughs> if I can throw a healing potion on an ally who's sitting on the ground bleeding out, you know, near death, I feel like I should be able to throw a, a, a neutralization poison potion at someone, you know? Oh, wait, what's over here? What is this secret thing? Oh, there's secrets everywhere. Okay. Um. Yeah, let's try it. Only one way to find out, says Kavinda. <laughs> yeah, you're not wrong. All right. Uh, can I throw right from the menu, or do I have to dr uh, antidote? Throw. <laughs> <laughs> this lady, she's like, "Do you have a spell that can help my legs function normally?" And I'm like. Oh yeah, just stand still. I'm going to cast this spell. <laughs> Don't move. <laughs> Abracadabra. <laughs> and I just hit her in the head with a bottle. Maybe I should... No, no this is good. <laughs> he said, maybe I should... No, this is good. This is a restricted area. Time to explain yourself or this guard will be... I can perfectly explain myself. Sense. I was throwing a bottle of, uh, of magical liquid at your friend. Okay, that uh, I hit. That was what I was doing. And that is a perfectly reasonable thing for a person to do. Uh, try to convince them you belong here. 
I guess I'm just gonna try to talk. Uh, belong here sounds like it's gonna be harder, but maybe the effects will be more effective. Oh, this is Lazel. Oh no. Oh no, Lazel. Oh no. Oh no. Okay. Well. <laughs> I feel like I have to answer as Lazel would, which is intimidation. This is my place now. <laughs> oh my god. This is so bad. Oh, this is so bad. This is so bad. I mean, I'll give everything I got. Oh, this is so bad. <laughs> oh, no. Lazel. Oh, I can roll again with inspiration. Ah. Uh. No, I'm not trying to take her home, Mochi. I'm trying to help. I'm trying to just help her move. And then this guy thinks I'm trying to... This is such a messy situation. This is so messy. I mean, I guess I have to use the inspiration, right? Like, I'm not gonna... Uh... Oh, this is awful. This is awful. <laughs> oh, come on. <laughs> You couldn't give me anything better than I... You try your best, but your best yep. just isn't, it just isn't good, good enough. enough. Yep. Uh, I don't have the. I don't even think I have the gold. Right. I don't even think I have the gold to to bribe with. Oh, I can't even. Gosh. Uh, uh Well, uh, take me in, officer. I'm so sorry. <laughs> okay, uh, well, a starian, you're pretty good at this sort of thing. This is what happens when you try to help people. Oh. Have a lot on my mind and well, in it. <laughs> Why is this mushroom glowing? Oh, it literally is an exploding mushroom. It's not just like a poisonous mushroom, it's an exploding mushroom. And what a comedy of errors this this last couple of minutes has become. I try to help a lady by throwing a bottle at her head, and then a guard throws me in prison, and then I touch an exploding mushroom. This has happened within a 15-minute period. Oh, can I just sleep off my shame? <laughs> Apparently not. All right, Astarian, please help us get out of here. Oh, wait. Who's watching? Oh, this lady. Who, why, why, why do you care if she sees? Are we seriously not able to get out of here? Okay, thank you. Now. Open locked? What is this? Are we? What is happening here? Did they take all of our items? Hashtag no sleep off shame. <laughs> no items found. Yeah, they took all of our items. Okay. So what the hell do we do here? Evidence chest, equipment chest. Okay. 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 So we need to find a way to escape <laughs> without anything. No Okay. Can we jump? Oh, it looks like we can. Ha! Your cells mean nothing to me. Oh, but the exploding mushrooms do. Okay, ow. 
There's just a bunch of exploding mushrooms here. Why? Is this their defense system? Is just exploding mushrooms? And there we go. That's gonna blow up. Okay. We need to get back up here somehow. Oh, this is truly the worst day. Okay, okay, here we go. Here we go. Look at this. When there's a will. We just need to get our equipment and then we can, you know, we can, we can run away for a little bit. Don't mind us. We are merely just going to take our things and go. Wonder if the gods are watching me. Okay, just come on, everyone. Let's let's get out of here. Okay. Wonder if the gods. Oh, are me. every it's all on me. Are you serious? Go. <laughs> this is the worst escape. Get out of here. Get out of here, go! Go! Why won't you jump? Can I just go long rest? To camp? I cannot fast travel. What can I do? Did they literally just put all of my items on me? That is awful. Why would that be the way to do it? Why wouldn't it just all go back to who it belongs to? That is the worst. What do we do here? Uh, uh, <laughs> this is the way, says Mochi. This is certainly not the way. This has become the worst possible scenario. I think I just need to get rid of a bunch of stuff so that I can teleport far, far away and come back another day. But why would... If you touch your equipment, like, shouldn't it all come back to the person that it originated from? I feel like that is just the nice way to go about it. This just feels so unnecessarily complicated. Um, what else can I unpack off of you? Jesus. And also evidence chest. This was just all of my stuff. Okay, this was... I owned all of this. This wasn't stolen. I mean, some of it was stolen, but not specifically from you, I don't think. Oh, this is terrible. Oh, this is terrible. Come on. This is a mess. I just wanted to help. How am I getting thrown in jail? I was trying to help a woman not be paralyzed anymore. Okay. Oh, God. Get out of here. Just let's go. This camp is the worst. We, You know what happened when we went to this camp? Some snot-nosed brat... Uh, stole from us and then we got arrested for trying to help people uh read my words of motivation from beans wolf you're an amazing adventurer with incredible potential don't let setbacks define you keep pushing forward and never give up <laughs> wolf remember that beans believes in you and knows you have what it takes to overcome any challenge thank you beans because right now i am very much Oh, of, of, of the opposite persuasion. What, why can I not jump? Can I go now? Can I just go to camp? What a wreck that was. Well, we can't go back there for a while, I guess, until our notoriety decreases. What a comedy of errors. Uh, oh, but you know what we can do? We can get, we can scratch, we can give, we can give pets to scratch. That makes everything better. Uh, never mind. If we can catch up to him. Well, friend. <gasps> oh, I'm always better when I'm with you, Scratch. I give you Scratches. Good boy. Good boy. <laughs> that poor woman's legs are probably being eaten by rats. No, we made friends with the rat. The rat was the one who told us about the poison. We are friends of the animals, as you can see, Mochi. The rat's not going to eat our friend's legs. As far as I'm aware. 
god, I really don't want to sort through all of their equipment right now. Can I just, like, take a long rest and hope all of this... Yes. Anybody have any conversation markers with me? <gasps> oh, uh, I thought it was my darling... I thought it was my darling sweet shadow heart. But instead it was Will. Will's cool. But Will's just not Bay, You know? He's not... He's not giving me goth mommy vibes. Which is truly what we need in our lives. Uh, but where is Shadowheart? I see Will here. I see Lazel wearing her leather <laughs> bralette. Because that's that's something that makes sense for her to wear. Um, yeah, I don't know where Shadowheart went. Uh, we'll find her. First, let's talk to Will, I guess. And take our good sweet time getting there. Because we are over encumbered. And I don't feel like dealing with that right now. A tingle runs through your head and down to your feet. Ah, there it is. That shiver. Our little brain worms have made fast friends, it would seem. How do you feel? Don't give them, like, characterizations like that. It makes you a little uncomfortable. Um. <laughs> surprisingly fine. Uh, nervous. I don't like the idea of that sing in my brain. It's natural to suffer a touch of worry, but an elithid worm should be causing more than mild anxiety. Before the elithid's unscheduled surgery, I'd felled hundreds of beasts and a fair few fiends. The tadpoles weakened me, suppressed greater talents, but... Oh, beyond, he's one of those characters who's I supposed no to be stronger before he joins our party. <laughs> no nausea, no pain, not even a hot flash. It makes no sense. I know why haven't we turned. It makes no sense. I know. Why haven't we turned? Perhaps the worm's vat was poisoned. Perhaps we're uncommonly fit. <laughs> or perhaps the tadpoles are merely on holiday. We could conjecture all night. I suppose the why doesn't matter so much as the what next. And that answer is plain as the horns on a war devil's head. We get these things out. Let's get some rest. Dawn comes sooner than we think. Oh, don't we know it will. All right. Um. Nope. Why does he keep doing that? It's like the weird attack button. Oh, I really don't want to sort all through there. Gosh darn things. Lazel, Kertrin, Will, Gale. Lazel's blue on the map. Everyone else is green. Is that weird? Is that normal? Is there a reason why she's a different color than everyone else? Is there a reason why some of my party members aren't visible on the map? I'm so confused. Wait, actually, now that I'm thinking about it, all of the characters who were in my party. Are not at camp. Why are you not all at camp? What is going on here? Why? <laughs> why are you? Why did only Lazel and me go to camp what <laughs> what is happening here i am so this session has truly been uh, unprecedented in like the faux pas that we are experiencing here why <laughs> they are all sleeping with the poor woman who doesn't have functioning legs. The one that we threw potions at, okay? We did everything right. The, the world was just not ready for our very innovative problem solving. Why won't you go to camp? I'm so confused. 
I've never seen that happen. I would like all of us to be together. This is truly wild. I don't know how to how to how to fix it. I mean Seems simple enough. This is so weird. I'm just gonna go to bed and like see what happens. Okay. And y'all are like still not here, huh? Wow, I'm so confused. I'm not gonna lie. Uh, I think I'm gonna leave camp. Uh, let's tell everybody to group up. And I mean, like, let's get out of here. Like, I don't know what else to do. Action, not reaction. I feel like, to be honest, I feel like I'm gonna have to go through everyone's inventory, sort their items back onto them, just so that we can, we can like continue, which is really weird. And I don't understand why that is. Cause I can't really do anything with, uh, with Kertrin until his, this is so wild to me. I can't really do anything with Kershren until his... Until his inventory is reset. And everyone for some reason is just following everyone else around. Everyone just do the same thing. Here we go. Everyone go over here. Yeah, neither will I. This is absolutely nuts. I am still so flabbergasted that all of their items sorted onto me. That seems so silly. That seems so, so, so silly. Yeah, I think what I might do... Let's put... No. Let's at least get Kirchner able to walk around. Great. Progress, right? Let's get out of the camp. Breathe deep and move. Because this has just been such a shit show. She's still paralyzed, so obviously whatever we wanted to do did not work. This is so wild. What is this? Blessed, bloodlust, accuracy. I mean, I'll take the stuff. But yeah, really? We need to get out of here. Why is also Asterion, like, not following us around or anything? Also, Shadowheart did have a dialogue prompt over the her. Blade of Frontiers. Let's hope Will lives up to his name. We'll need all the help we can get. Well, you know, I'm also very cool, so... Fine. What's on your mind? Okay, we have no other... Weird, I felt like she did have a dialogue prompt for us over here but i'm not gonna worry about that for now 
there's just a lot of happening that's going wrong at the end of the session, which <laughs> I just don't know why. Okay, here's what's gonna happen. I'm gonna have to store everyone's inventory and fix them. So I think now's probably a good place to save and figure out where we go from here. So I'm gonna pause for a second. I'm going to go back into the solo, the just chat. <laughs> Woof, okay, well everyone, uh, what an interesting session that this was. Uh, <laughs> I, uh, I don't know uh, if that was an effective bit of adventuring. I, I guess we did progress further into the dru druid's camp and then immediately got in trouble for trying to help someone, but I guess no good deed goes unpunished, literally. Uh, thank you for Fleetwood and Mochi to resubbing. As always, you are your time and energy is so appreciated. And thank you for Govinda for showing up. Any of our returning viewers, thank you so much for showing up. Uh, I am your host and Dungeon Master, Wolf Scott. Uh, it has been a pleasure playing with you tonight. What is uh, Level 1 Adventuring? If you're new here, we are a a D and d and, well, I should say a TTRPG, a tabletop role-playing game focus, focus stream. So we do play D&D. &D. We play 5th edition D&D &D as an ongoing campaign, but we also play digital versions such as Baldur's Gate. Um, I play more intimate single-player TTRPGs as well when time allows. So if you're into that kind of content, there's plenty to see here. Um, you can follow us here on Twitch. We'd very much appreciate that. We're sitting at 199 right now, so we're just under 200. Uh, so if we can get that extra one, that would be awesome. Uh, and also follow us on YouTube. It's where all the episodes will be posted uh, in the future. Join us on our socials, especially in our Discord. Uh, Twitch and Discord is where we post when we're going live. I should say X is where we post when we're going live. But the Discord is actually going to be starting as a 5th edition D&D play-by-post server very soon. Uh, I have openings in the Discord right now for slots to join. So I'm really hoping that the community will join together and adventure with each other because that would bring me so much joy. Um... And the Discord links are uh, all around, so we very much appreciate if we see you there. Uh, I think I won't be on until next week. We're definitely going to play some more Baldur's Gate. We're going to try to finish Thousand Year Old Vampire. There's a lot to see. Oh, I should say thank you for all of our stream partners, Stream Lab, Stream Audio, Stream Spell, Epidemic Sound, uh, AI Twitch Bot. Um, all of those services have links down below, and if you use them, it gives us a little kickback, so we always appreciate you helping us out in that way. Uh, but yes, uh, thank you so much for your time and energy tonight. I hope you had some fun watching me fumble around and getting in trouble with the local authorities. Uh, and uh, we hope to see you in the next installment of Kertrin's Misadventures. Uh, until then, drink your water, be well, sleep easy. Uh, and I'll see you soon. Hopefully see you on the Discord. So enjoy the rest of your night. I'm going to play that beautiful outro. What was that? It was a finger gun, but then I kind of like shot this trigger instead. Of... It's a finger gun. That's cool.